And we'll support, like, I was like, oh, your mum can't have a pants, give her money. He, uh, and he, she was like, okay, yeah. And I turned around, yeah, and what's it called? Instead of, like, asking for money, he's asking for fags. What? you got to be crazy. That, that's all you care about. Natter. All right, so, got these in the sky. Clean shit. You know, I wouldn't be like sat there, just like staring at these. I'm gonna get that battery as well. I know, see so you guys, gotta catch a couple more.
bloody hell's going on? Exactly from this house for like three minutes. I've been nerving them when I've been watching uh, YouTube. I know how to get you guys to see them better. Selfie stick. And Charlie. <coughs> so, my bag. Thanks. I'm just circling the bloody area. It's your boy Redux here, and uh, I got myself a little setup going on. I got asparagus, sirloin steak, halloumi, and that bitch. So, what we're going to be making is. Sorry, guys. It's. So steak and halloumi sushi rolls for a second. Let me just... That's that one, okay. So. Let's get some fire in this bitch. That's not fire. Okay. Learning. Here. Yeah. No, that's, that's, that's... I need a sh... <clears throat> We need fire. Actually. This is that side. That's that. That's that. The 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 So guys, I need a shit. Yo guys, I'm back and that bloody hurt. Anyway, so. Stop sliding like a bitch. Anyway, so. Anyways. Anyway, so. That's why I didn't want the camera boy there. Because then you just see that shit. Anyway, so. Yo, this is actually quite heavy. That's heavier than the punch. It's not as heavy as the punching bag, but it's heavy. Can 
be a long night is there any water in there? A second, guys. Kettles, you know how there's like the silver part, then the black part, and the black part isn't meant to burn you. That that I think that's quite hard because it it just burnt me. Wait, am I having tea? Yeah, I'm having tea. Let's test my tea making skills, isn't it? In the blood, in the blood. It smells very tea. Doing it with a spoon. This is my first time making tea. So. And I always, whenever, whenever I watch TV, I see people go like, "You put milk in first. So, water in first. Second. Yo guys, this is a method to making tea, isn't it? Boil the water. Preheat whatever you want to put in the tea the put put the tea in. This year. So does that mean I'll put this yeah, I'll put this in the oven. Do I? Put the tea in the fuser, strainer, or directly in the bottom of the teapot. Add hot water, let the tea steep, remove the tea leaves. Okay, oh, I know. So this goes in. Yeah, that. Shit, how am I gonna make steak and alumi sushi rolls if I can't even make bloody tea? Like, I've done it before, but by myself, I'm helpless. So, well, what do you do to make some tea? In it, lad. Um, no, I'm just going to make this because my mum made the best mac and, mac and cheese. That's it. Boom shakalak. I think it was, yeah, mac, mac and cheese and, I think, um, yeah, it was mac and cheese. I swear it was mac and cheese. Anyway, basically, it was mac and something and it was bloody amazing. So, she's at the rugby club and I said, I'll either catch up or I'm going to stay home. And devious little me for, I'm going to stay home. Oh yeah, I'm devious because I'm... I'm gonna make my mum a cup of tea. Well, not her. Like, you know, she doesn't want to have it. I'll have it. <laughs> I don't blame her if she doesn't want it. It's probably gonna be shit. <laughs> Treat your water kind. Okay guys, so to make a cup of tea, you treat your water kindly, run the tap a little, so the water's nice and aerated, and, once, oh, only, and, and only boil it once to keep the oxygen level up. You heard me right there. 
add tea and water to make tea you need to add tea I'm done um <laughs> uh wait patiently oh, sh give it a squeeze customize your boo your shit it's not Yorkshire tea if that's if that's then the nut is in it Okay, so I have a whole lot of shit in front of me. Oh, actually, yeah, there's pictures, that's easier. Get a cup, pour water in the kettle, do not then boil the water. Or sugar and tea bag in the cup. Yeah, I've just made a cup of tea. Why? Okay, let's do this, boys. I'm gonna boil the balls. Okay, tea. We have no sugar cube, so instead, get what we're doing, boys. Spoon. Okay, let's take the spoon of sugar. Yeah. Boom, yeah. Yeah, now it sounds demonic, that means it's good. But that's how I go by life, don't know about you. But, okay, that just sounds emo. Yo, I'm pro. That looks like my shit earlier. <laughs> and I thought myself off making tea. Um, do I stir it? It doesn't say anything about stirring it. Second. One second. Turn it on. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Get out, you bit. Oh, that's it. Actually, let me just make sure I get all the t-shirt out. All the t-shirt out. Oh! Oh! Ow! Ow, oh, that burns like a bitch. Ow! Shit! Yeah, they help me. Oh, I just got a 10 degree uh, burn. Yo, that... They never mentioned to move the bloody kettle away from you. Oh, that hurts. My fingers just gone numb. Ah, and the tea bag doesn't look like he's done his job. Look at this. Get back in there. Yeah, I'm squashing it. I'm so sorry, guys. I know I need to take my job seriously. Get tongs. Sorry, guys. Ben. It's drippy, isn't it? Eh, drip, 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 drip. Speed up the... Oh, screw you then. Not onto the halloumi, you slag. Yeah, now add some milk. How much milk? I don't know. Oh, that Audi looks amazing. Oh, yeah, I just made myself like... Yo! Drink that any day. I'm proud of myself. I'm I'm very proud of myself though. It's like a good cup of tea. 
Mind you, it's my first time making a cup of tea by myself. Guys, I'm actually just bloody amazing. <laughs> so somehow I I acted I really bloody nervous there, but uh, we didn't talk about that. Bath said you made tea. Boom! It's good. It's good. What's this shit called again? Alright guys, basically I forgot how to make this thing I'm going to make. No I haven't, I've remembered. Now I need to learn how to turn on an oven. How to turn, turn on. Turn, turn a oven. Another grill. Be sure to have proper ventilation. Looks proper to me. Open the oven and make sure there's nothing inside. So how do you open the oven? Oh, it was on the reason I forgot that. Um, oven grill. Because in, in the oven it's like cooking on the grill with the lid, with the lid down. Just as the lid on, the grill catches. Okay, first of all, I need to find out what's the shit on top of the oven. What's... What's... The... Shit... On... Top... Oven... Oven... Oven, ya mom! It's not my oven, but just pretend it is. No! Images, yeah. Yeah! Yeah, that shit! What is that? Yeah, how do, how do you turn it on? Oh, somebody's turned on. One second guys, I'm learning how to turn on the shit on the top. That's the light.
Is he turn it on? How, how do you turn it on? Do I have to make fire? How? Oh, dear. <laughs> I can never unlock that door. <laughs> Every time I make food, yeah, I never turn on the oven myself, so just saying I don't know how to turn on the oven. So there's gas. And uh, I remember in science, when there's gas, you know, she get like a matchstick. Matchsticks! God, we got those matches. Yeah, let's get some matches and like make a fire. Yo, I'm just saying, this is all like if anything happens, it's completely my fault because I'm an idiot. Is that matches? What are those? No, they're just, just things in there. Matches are usually in here to set a fire, start a fire. That's. But they're not. No? Okay, that's just medication. What about down here? I'm not even going to bother trying down there. to get a tissue or just kill somebody. <laughs> what do you do when you kill somebody? Well, I'll just get some tissue. No biggie. R.I.P. R.I.P. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. This is a worthy send off. I'm. I don't know why. I just like. I get weird around slugs and snails and. I'm so weird around them. I can't even play tell the difference. I don't give a shit what that is. It's just a slimy, slimy, scary thing I don't like. What am I doing? Of. No, the Tinder nest, the Tinder, yeah. Yeah, no, but I mean, like, I can't do that. <sighs> Shit, man. Hey, would steamy hot water help start fire? Because if I turn this on and then pour over, like pour like this when like the, when the gas is on, pour water on it, and the st and the ice is blowing the steamy hot, shouldn't that? No, actually no, that's just an idiot idea. Shit! I was scared to find out what that would have done. Hmm. I got an idea. No, I don't. I have an idea for like a millisecond. Okay. Matchsticks could be in here. 
but it's too much to dig. How am I gonna make this fire? I'm not being an idiot. You guys think I'm being an absolute idiot, but I'm not. I'm trying to figure out a method. Yeah, and if you think I'm being an idiot, guess what, mate? I'll, I'll risk you. Yeah. Whoever bloody put that on there. Oh, okay. I did. Right. I'll say, whoever really put that on there, it's playing me off the maker. Chipotle. Ah! There's five spices in ch- Okay. Spice. Spice, 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 spice. Do you know how to set a fire? Uh, I guess you're just bored of my shit then, aren't you? In a second, I just thought. Maybe there's Pokemon nearby, in a second. I'm just checking for Pokemon. Guys, while I was doing that, I, was, I thought that Ed Sheeran was saying, I see fire! And then I thought, no, no I don't. Lying bitch. <laughs> okay! I should pour that milk away. Right? Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> hey, actually, I found something there. No, that's just a bone. There's why is your bone in there? Is there anything in here to start a fight? No, it's a fridge, you mong. Not looking to you, I'm looking ah! I spoke to you everywhere and I got myself out. I am just so shit at making food now. I just am. I, I, I used to be decent, not not good life. That's they like to say in school, blow your own trumpet, but I don't want to blow my own trumpet, but it used to be actually decent. Now I'm just a mess. God, the man's you bloody hate this. I'm a little bit like God and Ramsey, I am. I like swearing and I like cooking. But the only difference is, he's good. One person's good, one person isn't. Quite a big difference. Um, yeah. Anyway, so, uh, do you don't know how, how to tell who's the best one? Because one of them knows how to bloody turn up, the, knows the words for the shit on top of the, that thing, ow, the thing of that. And as they, also they know the words, also they know how to bloody turn it on. I did it! We are the champions. Yes! Yes! Yo, this cooking show can actually get on the boat now. Now we've done that, I think we can leave again the shivering. Nice, nice! I can't use a, a knife. I can't use the same knife for two things. Okay, I need to wash my hands because I'm making a little mess. Okay, I'm actually so happy! Okay, so basically, I'm so happy. Okay, so this shit, butter.
guys, I'm so sorry. I'm trying to be as reasonable as I can with this. But guys, guess what? I see fire. Open you olive oil, bitch! I don't want to have to say it. Okay, I've got that olive oil on this. Make it go all over the shitty place. Try to in every single little gap. So it's very oily. So it's a little bit easier then. Okay, now I've done, now I've done that. Okay, yeah! Actually, I don't know why I have butter. Put the butter. Oh, shit. I, I have no time for this fire. This fire right beside me. I need to be very careful. Thank God, careful's my middle name. Okay, so what you do, you cut off, round about a whole block. Just to be safe. I'm gonna use this because I'm an idiot. It basically I, I mess up shit a lot. Why is the balloon me so hard to cut? No! You can't be running low on me now. Please, not now. Fire! Second go when I was right there. Bloody earth. Not gonna lie, it shocked me. I have to stand back for this. I'm trying not to just chuck it in just randomly, but I kind of want to. Then it could kill you at any moment. So it's the season to use my asparagus, no it's not really because, yeah. Okay, so I've got this good piece of asparagus, now I need to cut it. Thankfully, I forgot to get another knife. Actually, I'm going to use this knife because there's knives beside me that are really good at cutting shit. Okay, what you do, you cut it into four pieces, okay? There's nine pieces on there, I got four. I need to put some more halloumi so it's all even. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, very close at the back. And there's that, there's that. See, sometimes, well, not sometimes, most of the time, the halloumi it will get a little bit sticky. So you just want to top, uh, you just want to turn it around, you know, that, that, the basic shit. What have I done? Shit. Guys, this is what you should always do uh, when, when parents and some shit like that is about. So if you're not too careful, it could end very badly. Now we've got nine pieces. The real question is what bloody asparagus is this? Dun, dun, 
delicate and tender. And you want to turn this shit like mad. Like do not let it burn just on one side. We do your shit chef. That's why I'm messing up right now. So I need to get this, uh, another piece of asparagus in there. Not asparagus, it's halloumi. And you know, the other piece of halloumi that's just messed up, I'll, I'll have that later. Okay, yeah, you have to keep on tossing and turning. Yeah? See, I know what I'm doing. Yo, shit, that's too much, too much. Now what you do, you, you let it calm, what I call calm it shit. Also known as shit you messed up to pretend, then you got this under control. Now as it's just been on fire, it's very hot. I didn't realise this, so I kept it on and it's still going, not the flame, but the sizzle shit. This is a quick 15 minute, oh well not 15, less than 15. So probably a three minute sort of thing if you do it properly. Now, as I'm an idiot, uh, sorry, as I'm, as I'm an idiot, <coughs> what's it called? I, 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 when I was scared, yeah, I, I just, I'm like, uh, I'm like sort of touching weird things that I should, I shouldn't be touching when I'm making food. So, that's sizzling. I need to just go try to remember to laptop. off. I'll be right back. Hi, buzz. It's a buzz. It's a buzz. It's all okay. Everything is under control. Sometimes sometimes when you're making food it will get a little bit smoky. I'm trying to have like a plan a plan for some of this, but I really didn't because like Okay. As I touch my mum's laptop that is kind of messy at the bottom. You need to wash your hands again. You don't want any germs going on your food. I don't mind my own germs, that's why I'm touching my hair. But the fish is confusing. Okay guys, so um this is meat. And uh, meat can be, well, when you make your food, it can go very wrong. So, if any of my younger viewers are watching this at home, and when I say younger, come on about my age, 11, so so odd. Um, I have parents with you. The uh, thing is, I don't have parents with me because I'm an idiot. And also, I've got to learn how to cook by myself, so I've got, got to do it one day. And... If any of you guys say, well, actually, I'm going to do it by myself because I've got to look, learn how to cook. <laughs> See, now this is falling on the floor. Screw that bitch. Yeah, pour fairy liquid all over that. So, can't be bothered to do the rest of the dishes. Sorry, mum. And, um, yeah, just. Make sure you clean so all the fairy liquids are gone because I don't, I'm pretty sure you don't want any fairy liquid on your thing. So now I've done this. Okay. Put this on the side. Anyway. So guys, remember meat? Uh, yeah. 
it's like it's not good for you and shit. So when you're doing this, make sure you don't touch your eyes or anything. And I'm about to be using something that I shouldn't be. So mum, if you see this video, I am so sorry. But I'm angry. <laughs> and you know, I'm angry. I have my phone on me, I have YouTube capture. There's only one way this can go. So, um I will try and show you how I'm cutting this, but I need to be as safe as I can because I really don't want to cut my fingers doing the YouTube video. Well, I don't mind, like, YouTube video. Don't mind. Cut my fingers for a YouTube video. That's, that's a limit for me. But, okay, so what I'm going to show you now is, I'm not going to do it, but when, when you're cutting, go like that. So if you accidentally hit yourself, so you're going to take so might take your skin off but it won't go like tss, tss, tss. basically it won't be bloody awkward and bleedy very bleedy it won't be as bad as the bloody uh, thing I'm, uh, the steak the sirloin steak I'm cutting right now so that's why you need to clean every part of you because you gotta be prepared boys now as I'm shit I'm cutting when I was cutting it going back going back forward I went in several different directions. Okay, this is a dumb idea. I don't know why I'm saying this, but I'm just saying. Feeling the steak, it just feels so like... Eatable as it is. Oh shit, okay. So this knife is not helping right now. Man, please don't get mad. But. Also, remember to always cut on, uh, cut on a chopping board. Because there's a reason why it's called a chopping board. Okay, what I'm going to do with my hands. Do I, guys, as, as you know, I wash my hands, but. I making it wider so I get more meat. Well, not more meat, but more slices because it doesn't matter. Like, you know how people say it doesn't matter about the quali uh, quality, uh, quantity, just the quality. Well, what it is, it doesn't matter how uh, the quality of how much meat is in it, but it doesn't matter how much quality, uh, qu quantity in the sirloin steaks. Yo, this knife is actually OP. Yo, this knife is amazing! So guys, I just gotta make sure I cut every single little piece of that. Ow! So you guys accidentally, accidentally just touched the black bar. So if you want to roll a black part, I'll show you once I've finished cut, done cutting the steak. I'm actually thinking about it, I'm going to get the worst telling off of my life just to make a bloody YouTube video of me eating food. Well, not just eating food, but like, making food. I'm going to, like, I'm, I'm going to, after I'm done, I'm going to call, call my mum to say, Yo mum, make food, come on, right now. And if she doesn't, I'll be like, yo, if you don't come on right now, yeah, you're not going to have any of this food. But that's just gonna be like a trick to go like, yeah, that's why. I know you can know now. And then yeah. Honestly, I'm actually very proud of myself because I feel like I'm being very mature. I know this is like I'm being very hygienic right now. Like I, I know this is a little bit dirty, but 
I'm saying. But like, I'm not usually this hygienic because like, ah, this uh, that sounds like just disgusting. But what's it called? Um. You know. I'm, I'm, what I'm touching right now could be very dangerous for me. Like, but I'm saying the steak is dangerous. Yes, actually, the things that are cont uh, in the steak, yeah, and the gyms I may have, if I touch this steak, put the gyms with it, onto there, well, it, uh, no, like this steak is more more likely to harm me than this knife. Because I'm being sensible with this knife. It's quite hard to control steak. <laughs> anyway. So, I'm just like, stretching these parts of the steak out. As I did earlier, I'm just making them wider. This is the fattest piece. But, what you've got to keep in mind is, you know, you, you need to try and get as little fat as there possible. Shit, I forgot, I need to get those off and I have too much things in. I was about to say my workspace, but it's not my workspace. Not yet. My cup of tea. That is good. I'm proud of myself for that. It's actually very good. Anyway. Maybe I think it's good because I made it, I don't know. Anyway, so what I'm doing is, um, so I'm going to make these wider because then I'm going to put an asparagus and some halloumi between each part. And it's one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six pieces. Shit. And I have nine there. But that's the book. Okay. As if there's a will, there's a goddamn way. I meant to like, like, make burn the halloumi. Split. I think it's my dad loves the heads of asparagus because he's just demented. So I'm gonna have one especially for him where it's just two heads. That's it, because he says the heads are the best. So, okay, okay, this head. Thing is, I know this is so irresponsible, and if you're gonna do this, do this around parents. But I wanna make this as a surprise for my mum. After she made probably the best mac and cheese I think I've ever had in my life. Oh, but this is gonna be shit. I could, I have, I, I. She's an amazing cook, yeah, and whenever I'm making, whenever I'm making something, ask her to help and just, you know, sort of things. And it's amazing, and I'm, I do, I call it my mum's magic touch. You know, but the the mum's magic touch of, with food because they just have, I swear, this they gods with food, man. Anyway. Yo, there's just, just, there's just gonna be one part which is just pure steak. I mean, halloumi doesn't have to be cooked, but it's better when it's cooked. Trust me. Oh, it's got some halloumi and some asparagus. Put the halloumi right there. Fast piece of asparagus I think I've ever seen in my life. <sighs> okay, this one that's just gonna be pure halloumi. Oh, yo, I love halloumi. Uh, like I, 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 uh, uh, even though I made it, I was like, you know, I know I made this and all, but like, so I should at least try it. And I did try it with the the 
the asparagus, that's the word. But I just went like, nah man, that's shit. And they were like, Bleh. and I'm like, look, I'm just gonna like, I don't mind. I don't, I don't say I don't mind. I'm like, I, I hope you don't mind. That's what I'm gonna say. When if I do this, but it's gonna take this bad this out of most of them. And I did. So so what I'm now doing is I'm gonna wrap. These, you know, this is a shit tutorial because all you're seeing is my face. I'm gonna wrap these into things like this. That's why I call them, that's why, that's why I said steak and aluminum sushi rolls. Who's the wrap like sushi? It's in the name, isn't it? Steak and aluminum sushi rolls. Sushi roll, sushi rolls. Being very careful not to touch the frying pan. This is you a dick, Wad. This steak's a dick, Wad. Okay, so I'm cooked steak. Like it's like very sticky, so it squeezes together. Well, it doesn't squeeze, well, it is very squeezy to be fair. Um, it's like, it's kind of like Play Doh. Um, but what's it called? It's like, um, it's like, like, it sticks together well. So it's easier to make things when it's wrapped in it. Oh, yo, if my mum watches this video, no offence. I think I did a little bit better without you. No offence. <laughs> no offence to you, man. I love you, but I think I did this really good. Actually. So what I need to do now, I need to watch the spatula. There's stuff on it. Okay. Very liquid. Make sure these are as clean as can be because if they're not clean, then there's definitely, well, not definitely, but okay. Now, what I need to do, I have to stay, stay, takes a little while. So I'm going to show you what I've done so far. I have put this in this like that. Uh, I because a bloody great explanation, Will. So why he started off doing? I cut the. I I I don't want to like hold this as well because it's very unsafe. But I, I cut this to four quarters because they're massive. See, massive. Uh, I only use like two. Um. <laughs> And uh, what's it called? I got the hood with me and I cut it in, I tried to cut it into cubes or sticks. So I can that's very nice. Uh, and then I put olive oil on this, turned it on, put them on. Now, what I'm saying is don't be too close to it. Because... One second. I'm very happy now because this is going pretty much exactly how I wanted it to. So far, none of them have been that. Um, yeah. 
Yeah, this one's a fast cooker, I swear. See, all he's already done on the side. It's not going to get everything perfectly done like that. I think that's even better. Anyway, um, I'll have this like this. Um, yeah, so my cutter tried to put it into like stripes. And it's just saying, he was like, hi, get your mum or dad to use it. Not like that. Not like that because that's shit. Um, or maybe I'm just too weak, I don't know. Um, now you've done that, you want to lay it out. Well, these are still like, try and make the halloumi and the asparagus are still sizzling. Well, the steak is it in strips. As it's in strips, well, you know, yeah, try and flatten it out. Make sure you have washed hands after you do. Not every thing with some things like you don't really need to wash your hands, but like if you touch the steak and stuff like that, you need to wash your hands just after you touch anything else. Um, and you need to clean up everything you use after. But when I say clean, like clean everything you use, put everything back. La di da di da, a second. It's actually a decent tea. If that's why, I can hear the bloody helicopter above me. Again. Oh shit. Oh shit. Thing is, the, the piece will come on this side. Ow! This is this shit. When it pops out, it has to be on a verse. You know, I'm not gonna lie. I think this should. I should wait a little bit longer. A second. I've been recording for an hour. I swear that doesn't take an hour. It's just. It's just how long it took. It took me to turn on the bloody grill. Anyway, I'm gonna wait a little bit and until it's done.